right, it's time for another million dollar idea. And this one may actually make you hungry. I hope he brought some hot dogs. All right, when <laughs> cutting up a hot dog became tedious, one Central Florida dad started drawing up a new way to get it done. Fox 35's Lauren Johnson meets the man who invented the dog dicer. Blood is in eyes. For Jeff Coffey, music was his life. It's how he made his living. I've been a professional musician for over 20 years and was looking to do something different. Then he stumbled upon something different in his kitchen with the kids. Kids love hot dogs and we were cutting them up to make them safe to eat. But it became a tedious task for mom and dad at mealtime with the boys. After years of doing it with a knife, I said, man, there's got to be a quicker way to do this. So he searched for a hot dog slicer and he couldn't find one, so he decided to make one. So I sketched the idea out on a piece of paper and I always wanted it to kind of look like um, an egg slicer, but shaped like a hot dog. So it would be familiar to people. This was the first kind of one of the many first prototypes that we did. But the first was not the last. I went through three different local developers to try to get this product perfect, try to get it to working right. And those were some tough times. It took two dozen prototypes before the dog dicer finally hit the market. Come to the finished product. Four years later, the dream was a reality. It's been a good response. And now, we're, we're, like I said, we're moving into uh, retail, so that's going to be good. After playing with the invention, Coffee's wife and business partner started to discover other uses for the dicer. Strawberries, bananas, grapes, and even eggs. It'll make a little meal for your toddlers really fast. Now he's hoping to make some fast money to make up for cutting music out of his life. Lauren Johnson, Fox 35 News. All right, and Jeff is joining us right now. I got to tell you, this is every parent's dream. You invented every parent's dream, right? <laughs> well, Don't you I, wish I you love had it. One yes, of these? absolutely. Yes. I wish I would have thought of this. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, the whole idea, you always hear that uh, hot dogs are the number one choking hazard for right. kids. That was yes. pointed out there. Uh, so, was this one of those things that just stimulated? You thought, man, I got to come up with a better idea? Well, when I was, uh, when my, my children were small, I was always cutting them up with a knife. And we've all done it yes. for a long time. You cut it up this way and then you cut it lengthways just to get rid of that round shape, which is the, the actual choking hazard shape you like your esophagus and so I, I just thought there's got to be a faster way to do this. Everyone's looking for a faster way to do something and I thought well let's just go look for an egg slicer but we couldn't, I mean I'm sorry, a hot dog slicer. Couldn't find one so I decided to make one that's and pretty cool. uh, here it is. Well it, it's brilliant because right you automatically do think of the egg slicer. I mean that's right. the first thing you think of and everybody thought I'm sure at the time that the egg slicer came out what a brilliant idea but also grapes are another thing that moms and dads mm -hmm. too we're constantly cutting them up. Again it's all the little round things that we yes. worry about our toddlers. With. Very scary. Very scary. They can choke on a lot of these, uh, a lot of these times of food, and, and it's very easy to choke. All on. right, but let's see if it actually works because I, I can just imagine, <laughs> good you know, a strawberry. You buy this, you take it home, and just squishes. So let's yeah. see. All right, we're putting well, you on the spot here. Yes. Here's some of the food. So the hot dog. Let's go with the hot dog Honestly, first. It's we know that like one. Hot work. dog. Yeah. Now, do you usually do it uncooked first, or do you usually cook it first? People, Does it matter? It's your preference. Okay. Whichever your preference okay. is. Uh, uh, you see, sometimes sometimes cook it. How sharp? I'm touching these, touch the food. I'm wondering about kids doing this. So, yes. probably not the best idea because the kids. Well, get a I finger. would say definitely supervision. Okay. But it's really meant for parents to prepare their meals for children. It's okay. not really a kid's kind of a play gotcha. toy. Okay. But it's really meant for parents to quickly serve their meals to the kids. All right, let's see the dog. So, yes, it, put it in, push it down. Look at that, it's so easy. Just like that. And then you just look at that. scrape it onto the plate. Why that did you incredible. think of this ready? I know, I'm so mad to kick myself, right? Completely eliminated that round <laughs> shape. All right, let's try grape. I want to see if it squishes the grape. <laughs> grape. <laughs> Actually, I'm having a salad. I love it. Okay, oh, and I'll, as you're squishing here, I'll help you out, Jeff. Oh, well, thank as you you're, very much. As you're squishing over here, talk My to me a little bit here. about about just what this has been like to see uh, the success over the last uh, year or so. Well, it's been, it's been a lot of uh, a lot of interesting avenues that we've gone down. Yeah. You know, it's, it's great to see the response. Um, but there's a lot of hard work that goes into this. There's a lot I mean, of hard work. The business aspect of that, was that all something that for you was sort of new? Well, it, in a sense it was. There, everything that we had to learn the business, everything, every aspect of the business was a new avenue. Mm -hmm. So it was a lot of research, a lot of interviewing different companies for different things, um, but very much, very similar to the music business in the sense that you're trying to advertise something. Right. So it's kind of underdog advertising. You're the expert. I want to try this. And by the way, it's as seen on TV, as seen on Fox 35, and you have a special deal for Fox 35 viewers this right. morning, right? Yeah. Yes. If you can go to our website, dogdicer.com, and enter the code when you're purchasing, yeah, it'd be good to keep, cut that in half. Yeah. <laughs> Make it fit. Looks if you can enter, enter the code FOX35, and you're going to get 35% off today. I love it. You can 
also find these at Amazon.com, is that right? Amazon.com, you okay. can find it. And uh, AsSeenOnTV.com. Oh, look at that. And AsSeenOnTV stores. I love Bananas. it. Bananas. For the kids. Fascinating. Bananas. I love it. Great Instant job, meal. Jeff Coffey. We were really impressed, honestly. Thank you. This is parent's dream. Right I know. Here. Love it. Nice job. I won't <laughs> shake your hand. That's, That's all right. That's banana. All right. Hey, we'll put the info on our website, MyFoxOrlando.com. We'll be right back here on Good Day Orlando.